references to a forger named Fade in CSEC crime reports, Shepard. Perhaps that is a good place to start looking. Also, according to CSEC, a drill recently passed through customs. The CSEC office may have more information. Can I help you, sir? It's been a couple of years since I passed through here. Security seems to have tightened a bit. After the Geth attack, there was a review of security protocol. A few minor changes were made to reduce the risk of Geth infiltration. We apologize for the inconvenience. But you're banning things like pressurized gas canisters. Volus need those on their enviro suits. The system isn't perfect. We're working on it. In the meantime, everyone must cooperate. Thanks for your time. Next! You'd think Citadel security would be the tightest in the galaxy. I see no fewer than 14 fatal flaws a skilled assassin could exploit. Eight of them existed when I was here ten years ago. Yes? My associate is trying to find his son. We think a local criminal may have hired him. That should be easy. We don't see many drell here. There we go. One of my men reported a drill recently. And he was talking to Mouse. Interesting. Mouse? Ah, uh, petty criminal. Probably not the guy who hired your boy, but a messenger. He's a former duct rat. Runs errands for anyone who'll pay. What was it you called, Mouse? A duct rat. It's a local slang for the poor kids who grow up in the station. When they're small, they tend to play in the ventilation ducts where adults can't get to them. Aren't the ducts dangerous? Every couple of months, we pull a little body out of them. Lacerated by fan blades, broken by a deadfall, suffocated by vacuum exposure. Those are just the ones we know about. More just disappear. Maybe they get sucked into space. Maybe they fall into the protein vats the keepers run. The mouse survived long enough that he can't fit in the ducts anymore. He was one of the smarter ones, or the luckier ones. What sort of trouble has Mouse been getting himself into? Odd jobs for shifty people. Duct rats take whatever is available to get by. Data running, fencing stolen goods, selling illegal VI personalities. Actually, he was selling one of you. Me? Yeah, when you erased a file, it would say, I delete data like you on the way to real errors. That's pretty extreme, Shepard. Laugh it up, Tally. Buggy, though. It crashed every half hour. The error message was about how the galaxy was at stake, and you should fix the problem yourself. I've heard enough. Mouse is usually upstairs outside the Dark Star. He works out of a public comm terminal. You should pick up a copy of the Shepard VI when you talk to him. It sounds like your boy's running with the wrong crowd. Yes, I agree. If Mouse can't get you in touch with your son directly, he'll know who can. I'll help you if you need it. You don't know us, Captain. Why are you going so far to help us? I've worked Zakara for two years. Every day kids turn to crime because they've got no other choice, because their parents don't care. You're trying to save yours. He faces a dark path. We better hurry then. You didn't tell him that Kolyat plans to assassinate someone. I also didn't tell him what you do for a living. Do you normally discuss assassinations with the police? I take your point. Thank you, Shepard. You can strip the copy protection. Just cost more. Yeah, I got the package. It'll be there. Don't worry. I'll deliver it myself. That won't happen. You can count on me. Yeah. 
Uh huh. Oh yeah, no, I understand. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You won't be disappointed. Well, I just need a bit more time. It's not my fault. Nobody told me the package was in two parts. Yeah, I know. I'll get it. Don't worry. End of day, no later. You can count on it. I, I understand. That, that won't be necessary. I'll throw in a copy of the Shepherd Vi. Hey, I've always worked real hard on that. Yeah, sure. I can get you two cases by the end of the day. You mouse. What are you? Oh shit, Krios. I thought you retired. Commander Shepard? I, I thought you died. What do you want with me? Be still, Mouse. You can change your pants in a moment. How do you know Thane? Krios? He didn't... If he didn't say nothing, I ain't either. When we heard the name, I didn't think it could be the same Mouse. He was a contact on the Citadel when I was active. He and some other children would gather information on my targets. You put children in danger to spy for you? Children, the poor. My people's word for their kind is Dralafa, the ignored. They're everywhere, see everything. Yet they are never seen. You gave another Drell instructions for an assassination. Who's the target? I, I don't know. I, I didn't ask. Because the people I work for? We don't have time for this. Ah, oh God, Thane, help me. Help me, Mouse. My son is out there, in the dark. That's why I carried for him. I thought you'd want me to. Please. Explain. He came in, said he was looking for work. He had a hollow of me, the, the one you took, Krios. I put the word out. Use your old contacts. Elias wanted to hire him. Elias Kellum. One other thing. That Shepard VI you're selling? Oh shit, you heard- Look, you were dead. It was totally legal to make a VI of you. You made money using my likeness. I think I deserve some of the profits, don't you? Oh, sure. How about I just transfer some money to you? I mean, you know, why bother with all the lawyers and taxes and junk, huh? Tell me about Kel. Human. Moved to the Citadel about ten years ago. He was little people when you were here, Krios. He got big after the Geth attack. Lots of the big guys from before got cacked, all in the big fancy apartments up on the Presidium. Now he runs the rackets on the lower end of the ward. Shin Akiba. He's seriously bad news. I didn't want to do that, Mouse. We just don't have much time. Just go away, man. Mouse. I'm sorry, too. Just go. That couldn't have been easy. Mouse knew more about my life than Kolyat ever did. He smiles up at me, broken teeth and scabby knees, bare feet black, a dead-end future looking up at me, worshipping the petty gifts I offer. I was the only good thing he had back then, but I left him as I left Kolyat. Mouse said you had a hollow of him. Yes. A foolish bit of sentimentality. I can perfectly recall every moment I spent with Mouse. He pulls at my arm, smiles. He wants to know that I'll remember him, that anyone will remember him. I take the hollow. He smiles at himself in miniature on my palm. Then a frown crinkles his brow. He pats my pockets, checking for other hollows. Where's your son, Krios, he asks. Don't blame yourself. If I don't, who will? We must carry the weight of our decisions, Shepard. You, of all people, know this. Let's head back to Bailey. Captain Hannah Shepard has apparently turned down an Admiral's star and will remain in command of the Orizaba. The captain deemed her promotion to Admiral a political ploy and said that she could best honor her child's legacy by captaining a ship.
Yes? Can we talk about my associate's son? You talked to Mouse? Did you get the name of the guy he's working with? Elias Kellum. Kellum? Oh, shit. Uh, look, this is awkward. Kellum and I have a, an agreement. He doesn't cause too much trouble and buys tickets to the C-Sec charity ball from me. In return, I ignore him. You want to accept bribes? Fine. I don't care how you run your precinct. I want to know if you're going to help me. Yeah, I'll help. Absolutely. I'll get some of my people to bring him in and set him up in a private room. You can interrogate him yourself. I'll stay out of sight. And if I'm lucky, Kellum will believe that I had nothing to do with it. Bring him in. We might not have much time. I'll make it happen. Wait here. We've got Kellum. Tell Bailey we're ready. He'll expect me to get him out of this. Not today, I think. Captain, his lawyer's here. Bet Elias has his VI set to page him if CSEC gets within 10 meters. I'll stall him. Get in there and work fast. We should question him together. Keep the pressure on. Thoughts on how we approach it? You talk to him. Appeal to his self-interest. I'll put the screws to him if he needs it. Very well. I'll pretend to be on his side. But if we waste too much time negotiating, Bailey won't be able to stall Kellum's advocate. Get me out of these restraints, Bailey. Pretty funny bringing me down here like this. Who the hell are you two? My name's Shepard. I'm a Spectre. Prove it. I don't have to prove anything. Spectres are above the law. We clear? Crystal. Good. Now, fortunately, I'm not after you. You contracted an assassin. Who's the target? Joram Talid. A Turian. He's running for office. He lives in the 800 blocks. Thanks. You won't see us again. No offense, but you're a problem below my pay grade. That may go down in history as the shortest interrogation ever. What's the story? Why'd Kellum hire the boy? Assassination. A Turian named Joram Talid. You know him? Joram? Yeah. You might have seen his posters around. He's promising to end organized crime on the ward. Thing is, his message is all mixed up in race politics. He's anti-human. Are things so bad that people can openly campaign as anti-human? Before the Battle of the Citadel, the alien population thought we were violent upstarts. Look what's happened since then. A human fleet guarding the station for months. C-Sec filled with humans. Anderson does what he can, but some people have lived on the station since before humans had starships. They see it as a coup. We need to stop this assassination. Can you get us to the 800 blocks? Sergeant, get a patrol car. These two need to get to the 800 blocks. Yes, sir. There he is. How do you want to play this? Follow to lead on the maintenance catwalks. Tell me what he's doing. The Krogan bodyguard will make him easy to follow. Where will you be? The darkest corner with the best view. I'm on Kira, Lord of Hunters. Grant that my hands be steady, my aim be true, and my feet swift. And should the worst come to pass, grant me forgiveness. It's 
been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. You can count on it. Show the humans they won't get their way. Ha! Thanks. Just remember, it's not all about the humans. They couldn't have gained this much power without the Council's support. Taking back our ward is only the first step. We must remove the cowards and appeasers on the Council. This doesn't stop here. I won't rest until the humans have been removed from power. Other races wait patiently for hundreds or thousands of years to earn an embassy. To the humans, no! They win one battle and think they're owed a council seat. My people want a Krogan war before we ask for that honor. That's not how we do things. We respect tradition. Humans think anything ten years old is obsolete. Worthless. How can they contribute to a 2,000-year-old government? Have we seen anything good since the humans moved into Zakara Ward? <laughs> I like their food. <laughs> I'll have to take your word for that. I can't eat human food. But let's be serious. Since the Shinakiba Enclave opened, crime has increased. Incidents of racial tension are up 24%, despite 116 new CSEC officers assigned to the ward. Of course, most of those officers aren't Turians, or Salarians, or Asari. They're humans who turn a blind eye to the crimes of other humans. That corruption goes all the way to the top. Don't think a human with a CSEC captain's badge is any less a crook than the thugs he deals with. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. I'm on him, Thane. He's talking to some voters. Understood. You're in position? Yes. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. Looks like he's talking to another voter. Any sign of Cole yet? No. I'm moving to another position. Ahead of him. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. No problem so far. Stay close, Shepard. His guards is talking to the bartender. Looks like a shakedown. couple of mercenaries. Looks like the same group his bodyguard comes from. He looks nervous. Could be he's noticed you. Maybe he saw Kolyad in here somewhere. Also a possibility. There are obstructions ahead. I'll try to go around. Don't lose him. Yes, 
sir. Yes, sir. Hey, who are you? What are you doing back here? What am I doing here? What are you doing here? What? Do you have any idea how dangerous it is here? Dangerous? Get out of here, now, before it blows. Blows? What the... Run! All right. <laughs> I can't believe that actually worked. Stay with him. Heading to the lead's apartment. Call yet? This, this is a joke. Now, now you show up. Help me, Drell. I'll do whatever you want. CSEC. Put the gun down, son. Get out of my way. I'm walking out. He's coming with me. They'll have snipers outside. I don't need anyone. What the hell? Delete. Get the hell out of here. Yeah, yeah, I will. Take the boy into custody. You son of a bitch! Your father and I have killed a lot of people. You have it. There's no reason you should start. I read his files. What made it all right for him to kill all those years? I was six when the Hanar began to train me. I didn't know any better. Your mother woke me from my battle sleep. Then why did you leave her? Why weren't you there when she died? Your mother... They killed her to get to me. It was my fault. What? After her body was given to the Deep, I went to find them. The Trigger Men, the Ringleaders. I hurt them, eventually killed them. When I went back to see you, you were older. I should have stayed with you. I guess it's too bad for me you waited so long, huh? Kolyat, I've taken many bad things out of the world. You're the only good thing I ever added to it. This isn't a conversation you should have in front of strangers. Boys, take Koliat and his father back to the precinct. Give them a room and as much time as they need. I'm surprised you're not trying to arrest all of us. The kid obviously hadn't committed a crime in his life. Not so sure about the father, though. I have to get back to the precinct. Come on, I'll give you a lift. They've been in there a while. Uh, the kid's been through a lot. I ran some searches in the CSEC archive. About ten years back, a bunch of real bad people were killed. Like someone was cleaning house. The prime suspect was a drill. We never caught him. Someone like that is trouble you don't want to deal with. Someone's got to deal with it. Doesn't have to be me, though. How'd it go? Our problems are... They aren't something I can fix with a few words. We'll keep talking, see what happens. Your boy shot some people. No one I feel sympathy for, but there it is. 
That kid goes through the system, we both know he's there for the rest of his life. Those guys were a waste of skin. The scales. Whatever. If you've got another suggestion, I'm listening. Give him a job. He can work off his debt to society, and you can keep an eye on him. It sounds like more work for me, and I can't just deputize him into CSEC. You have to go through channels. I didn't say have him work for CSEC. I said have him work for you. Interesting. I'll think about it. Thank you, Captain.